Hi, welcome back to the Deep Learning IIT Rapport Week 9 Assignment 9. Coming to the questions, we have 100 words in the vocabulary. And what will be the size of one hot encoded vector for a given word of the vocabulary? That is 100. And the last date to submit this assignment is 27-324. In CBOW, we multiply one hot encoding word with the matrix. What do the ith column of the matrix represent? What representation of the ith word in the vocabulary? Coming to the third question, which of the following is a possible mathematical representation of one hot encoding for a word, word W in the vocabulary B? 1, 0, 1, so on, 0. Which of the following is a major limitation of a CBOW model? It is not, uh, it does not capture the order of words in the context. And what is the objective of uh, Skipgram method to predict the probability distribution of context words given a target word? Suppose we are learning the representation of words using GLOW representation. If we observe the cosine similarity between two representations VI and VJ for the words I and J is very heavy. Which of the following statement is true? Log, log, uh, log of X uh, IJ is equal to 0.8. What is the computational complexity of computing softmax uh, function in the output layer of the uh, neural network order of N? So coming which of the given uh, following corpus, here we have uh, some corpus and based on this uh, we have to answer the below questions. What is the size of the coherence matrix created using the vocabulary? 31 by 31. What is the PMI in the text? 2.5. Suppose we get the coherence matrix of dimension R n by n, we run SVD in the matrix. We do a K rank uh, uh, approximation of the matrix using SVD. What is the dimension of W word? That is m cross k now you can submit your answers and once you have submitted your answers you can see that assessment is submitted so that's all for today let's meet in the week 10 assignment and uh, subscribe the channel thank you